Hello friends, we trust you having a glorious day. We are so glad and honoured to encourage you again today. Psalms 1 verse 3. You are like a tree planted by the rivers of water that bringeth forth his fruits in his season. Also his leaf shall not wither, and whatsoever he doeth shall prosper. Oh glory to God! Hallelujah! That means as a child of God, you are and should be fat and flourishing. Again, that means always refreshed, always healthy, and do you know why? Because that's what the word of God does. Oh, glory to God. Hallelujah. When you pay attention to God's word, when you meditate on God's word, thinking it, talking it, praying with it, shouting it, it nourishes your spirit, soul, and body. Oh, glory to God. Hallelujah. I love it when God's word says in Joshua 1 verse 8, This book of the law shall not depart from your mouth, but you shall meditate on it day and night that you may observe to do according to all that's written in it. For then you shall make your way prosperous and have good success. Oh, glory to God. Hallelujah. Did you see that? He said that you shall meditate on God's word day and night. And then he said, in it you shall make your way prosperous and have good success. Oh, glory to God. Hallelujah. You see, it's actually up to you what to make of God's word. It's in your hands what to make of God's word. Right there where you are, you can say this with me. I am like a tree planted by the rivers of water. I am like a tree planted by the rivers of water. I am fat and flourishing. I am fat and flourishing. I am completely vitalized. I am completely vitalized. Energized. Energized. And strengthened. And strengthened. By God's word. By God's word. I am not a failure. I am not a failure. I do not fail. I do not fail. No organ. No organ. Failure. Failure. Is in my body. Is in my body. Because. Because. The life of God. The life of God. Is that work in me? Is that work in me? My future is prosperous. My future is prosperous. And I live. And I live in abundance. In abundance. Oh, glory to God! Hallelujah! Wow, wow, wow! That was awesome, divine. You know, life in God is always amazing. Above all, He gave us His Son Jesus Christ, who came, walked on the streets of this world, was crucified, and died on the cross was buried, and on the third day he rose from the grave. Hallelujah! Glory to God! And finally ascended into heaven, as the Bible recorded right before the very eyes of his disciples. Oh, glory to God! Hallelujah! What a miracle! They watched him ascend into heaven. Oh, glory to God! Hallelujah! And today we still use his name to prevail in all things. Maybe you're listening to us right now, and you're wondering, what are these kids talking about? Good question. <laughs> we are trying to let you know that we didn't appear on this earth from nowhere. There is a God in heaven who created heaven and earth with his words. In Genesis in the Bible, if you read, it talks about God's creation. How he started by forming the earth with his words. Separated heavens and earth with his words. Created land and water and separated them with his word. And then he created man. Hallelujah. Glory to God. That is me and you with his word. He created man with his hands, forming them with his hands and breathing air into their nostrils. Hallelujah. Glory to God. And so on and so forth. It went so on till there was too much sin in the world that he sent his son Jesus Christ to come and die for us that whosoever believeth in him shall not perish, but have eternal life. Hallelujah! That is taken from John 3 verse 16. Now, all you need to do is accept Jesus Christ as your Lord and personal Savior, and you belong to God's family. Hallelujah! Glory to God! Anyway, if God can form and create the world with his word, you can too, because he said in his word, as he is, so are we in this world. Hallelujah! God. Friends, use God's word. Use God's word. Say to yourself what the word of God has said about you. It is your responsibility. No one can do it for you. I'm a child of God. I'm a child of God. I am bought with a prize. I am bought with a prize. Greater is he that is in me. Greater is he that is in me. Than he that is in the world. Than he that is in the world. Christ in me. Christ in me. The hope of glory. The hope of 
glory. I am bold. I am bold. No weapon fashioned against me. No weapon fashioned against me. Shall prosper. Shall prosper. My body. My body. Is the temple. Is the temple. Of the Holy Ghost. Of the Holy Ghost. My future is prosperous. My future is prosperous. I am the righteousness of God in Christ Jesus. I am the righteousness of God in Christ Jesus. Greater is he that is in me. Greater is he that is in me. Than he that is in the world. Than he that is in the world. I am bold. I am bold. Greater is he that is in me. Greater is he that is in me. Mean it as you say. Greater is he that is in me. Greater is he that is in me. Than he that is in the world. Than he that is in the world. I prevail over circumstances. I prevail over circumstances. And challenges. And challenges. Because. Because. I'm a child of God. I'm a child of God. Mashakaraba sunta raba shanta raba mushunta mushunta raba shanta raba sunta raba shanta raba sunta. Oh hallelujah. To God. Maybe you're listening to us right now and you have not yet received Christ into your life. Don't worry, I will help you and lead you to Christ. Just repeat after me and mean it from the bottom of your heart. Just say, Oh Lord God, I believe in Jesus Christ, Son of the living God. I believe he died for me and God raised him from the dead. I confess with my mouth that Jesus Christ is the love of my life from this day through him and in his name I have eternal life I'm a child of God thank you Lord for saving my soul hallelujah congratulations you are now a born again spirit filled child of God Welcome to God's family. Hallelujah! God. Don't stop there. Locate the nearest Bible study church to you. Make sure to attend every Sunday, midweek services, Wednesday, and any more services in your Bible study church. This will help you build your faith in Christ and in the Word of God. Hallelujah! God. Thank you, friends, for watching. We trust you enjoyed this episode. And we'll be back next time with lots more on this channel. Bye! Hey guys, it's Mara again, and um, today we're making a cheesecake. Or oh, this is no cheesecake. Um, so, we've got the soft cream, we've got the double cream, we've got some chocolate to put inside, and we've got the cookie pan. So first, we just need to mop the butter which is already in the, which is already in the microwave. So I'm just going to put that for just a bit in the microwave for a minute and keep stirring it until it's done. And we need to finish um, we need to finish crumbling the cookies. So,
And now it's gonna last four years. Kind of texture like this. And now we're gonna put it into the pot. So now I've put the cookie crust in the fridge and we're going to be making the cheesecake filling. So you need half a cup of sugar. Cream. 
and then you grab your lunch. Mm, then you add um, two teaspoons of vanilla essence into the double cream sugar mixture. And I'm making flavour of vanilla with a bit of chocolate inside of it. And then you grab your electric whisk. And then you'll whisk it until it gets to stiff beats. When your batter, you should be able to take the bowl and flip it upside down on your head, and it shouldn't come out. Can you see? Um, it hasn't come out on my head. So now you're gonna get your soft cheese and mix it in. You need two four hundred grams of soft cheese and. The last time I made a cheesecake I added fruit into it but I'm adding like a bit of chocolate into that and um, so with the, the cheesecake you can add lots of different things so you can add chocolate fruits and all sorts of things so now I'm just adding a bit of chocolate in there I'm gonna grab the spatula and just mix it all in. And you can also add a little bit of food colouring in there. Um, I added a little bit in there, not a lot though. Um, we'll see if it's gonna mix in or not.
we want to make sure that everything is mixed, well mixed in. So if you like seeing that there's stuff on the sides, you just want to make sure it's scooped all in and mixed in. And as you can see, there's still a bit of food colouring in. So if you do add food colouring, you want to make sure that it's all mixed in. It gives us like a nice streak so the stuff will be in the to get the, the cup um, I'm gonna try here. And now I'm going to get the cross out from the fridge. So now we can get the piping bag. And we need to grab a cup here. And we're just going to put it around the cup. Using bigger chunks of chocolate, I would advise using a bigger nozzle so it will be easier for the chunks to come out of the piping bag. So I'm just going to take this out and hold the top, then I'm going to squeeze it through. And I've chosen this type of nozzle to give it. Like a type of design on there. I'm just going to put a little bit of chocolate on top of the, the cheesecakes.
I finished eating the chocolate, the chocolate on top of the cheesecake. So now I'm going to put it back into the fridge. Okay, so I left the cheesecakes in the fridge for an hour and it looks like they've set now. So I'm gonna get my siblings to try the cheesecake. Mars, my And you, not, you can use any biscuits. We um, chose hobnobs because they're my favourite biscuits. Um, but you can use digestives. I'm gonna mix it with like any biscuits. Because I like it mixed. To make, to make it more yummy. To make it more yummy. What's your opinion on the, the cheesecake? Yeah, tastes nice. Moss, what's your opinion? Um, I like it, but it makes me fun and it will make me laugh and it always makes it to make it more nicer. I really like the cheesecake because it's not too sweet and then the chocolate gives it like that extra hint of sweetness in it. So, yeah. So, that's all for this video. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye. Bye. Yum, yum, yum. Yummy.